All right, so today we're gonna be talking about sleeping bags. Now I have three sleeping bags here that look a lot alike and they are very similar, but there is a lot of differences between the three. Uh, starting here, I'm on the green patrol bag from the military module sleep system, which is a 30 degree bag. I have a Outdoor Vitals 20 degree bag, and then I have a TNH Outdoors 32 degree sleeping bag. Uh, all three of these are mummy bags, so they taper down at the feet and have a foot box. All three have hoods, like your standard mummy style sleeping bag. But by comparing these three, I learned quite a bit about sleeping bags. And so I figured today I would share that knowledge with you so that uh, you know what to look for when you purchase your next sleeping bag. So stay tuned. All right, so starting with this patrol bag. Now this comes in a system that's really expensive. In my opinion, it's expensive, but it's worth every penny. Uh, it makes it a well-rounded four season kit when you buy the full MMSS. Uh, but just the green patrol bag is actually really affordable if you buy it just by itself. And uh, the all three of these bags are pretty affordable. They're not real, real expensive. Uh, and they all kind of have the same weather rating. This one is by far the warmest, the Outdoor Vitals. But this is still a nice sleeping bag. And the thing that I like most about this bag is how much room you have on the inside. Uh, it's the same dimensions as the Outdoor Vitals sleeping bag, but it's very thin. It's really, really thin. So there's a lot of room on the inside uh, and so you get a lot of room in there to move around and roll around, but it's not as warm as the Outdoor Vital sleeping bag. And so the Outdoor Vital sleeping bag is the same dimensions as the patrol bag, but it's a 20 degree bag so it's warmer and it's thicker, it's got a lot more loft. And so there's not as much room on the inside as there is in the green patrol bag but there's still plenty of room. You can still fully zip up in it and roll around and uh, it's just not as roomy as the green bag. Uh, when it comes to the TNH Outdoor uh, sleeping bag, this one is a lot more narrow, but it's longer. And so for me personally, I don't fit inside the sleeping bag. My shoulders are too wide and so I can't zip this up uh, inside of it and my shoulder hangs out the end. And so I can't use this as a sleeping bag, but luckily you can unzip it fully and it has this little baffle here, this little connector piece here, so that you can use it as a top quilt. And that's how I've been using this, I've been using this as a top quilt seeing as that I don't fit in it to use it as a sleeping bag and so the fact that it has that option is really good uh, my son actually uses this he's five he's almost six and so he's gonna be using this sleeping bag and uh, he fits in it perfectly uh, it's really long for him but other than that uh, but what I see the benefit of this is is it's a very very affordable top quilt uh, it's very inexpensive, uh, it's long, so if you're taller, <clears throat> it's going to perform well for you. And uh, yeah, it's, it's not really a sleeping bag in my opinion, because if I don't fit in it, being as little as I am, I'm sure it's not going to fit most people. And so it's almost going to have to be used as a top quilt, where the patrol bag... The zipper doesn't come undone, and so you have to worry about it's the zipper separating or you breaking the zipper if you use it as a top quilt. And the Outdoor Vitals sleeping bag does unzip all the way, and it has a baffle as well. It's got this black baffle, so that you can use this as a top quilt as well. So this. These two can be used as a top quilt 
with no worries at all. This one can be used as a top quilt, but you're better off using it as a sleeping bag. Uh, other things that I wanted to mention is the zipper on the patrol bag is very smooth. It's very easy to go up and down. Uh, it's very big and robust and heavy duty. It's a YKK heavy duty zipper. It's a great, great zipper. Uh, the Outdoor Vitals sleeping bag has a really good zipper as well. It's a YKK, but it has a uh, no snag attachment on it, which uh, allows you to, yeah. hooking these back up is kind of a pain. It's a pain for both the Outdoor Vitals and the TNH Outdoors. So that's something you have to keep in mind. I'm not cutting that out because I want you to see that it's not the easiest thing in the world to do. It's it's doable, but it's not the easiest thing in the world to do. So if you do have it like that, uh, just know that it's kind of a pain to get it back in. The TNH Outdoors is the same way, but the TNH Outdoors you're probably just going to leave as a top quilt. You're never going to re-zip it back up. And so keep that in mind. Uh, the TNH Outdoors sleeping bag, uh, the zipper has this, it has the zipper and then it has this plastic no catch design on it so that it doesn't catch, you know, it pushes the fabric out of the way while you're zipping it. So that's a really good feature as well. Uh, so I really like the zipper on the Outdoor Vitals. I really like the zipper on the patrol bag. Uh, I'm not a big fan of the zipper on the TNH Outdoors, but like I said, you're probably not going to ever use the zipper anyway. Uh, when it comes to warmth, the Outdoor Vitals is definitely warmer. Uh, the patrol bag is with the right clothes, it's warm. Uh, the TNH Outdoors is warm as well. Uh, another thing that keeps it warm is it has this baffle on the inside around the neck and it goes around the whole thing. So it starts in the back and it goes all the way to the front. And so you can really wrap it around. So when you're using it, like when my son is using it as a sleeping bag, it closes him in and keeps the heat in. Uh, but when you're using it as a top quilt, because it runs the whole length, you're able to wrap up and keep warm and keep the heat uh, below you. And so that's a good feature on the TNH Outdoors. Uh, the Outdoor Vitals does not have that and the uh, Patrol Bag does not have that baffle. But when it comes to the zipper baffle, the zipper baffle on the TNH Outdoors is maybe an inch thick, probably about an inch thick. That uh, so when you zip it up, there's an inch here to uh, keep the draft and the cold from getting into the zipper. Where if you look at the outdoor vitals, you get like two inches. It's twice as big as the TNH outdoors, and the uh, patrol bag is about two inches as well. So you get a really good seal with these zippers. Uh, but again, this is probably going to be used more as a top quilt, so you really don't need the seal to be as thick and robust as you do with these, because these you will be using as sleeping bags. Uh, the other cool thing that the Outdoor Vitals sleeping bag has is it has a pocket right here. And so you can put uh, electronic devices, you can put your cell phone or your spot device or your fuel if you don't want your fuel to freeze and get cold uh, there's a pocket here that can keep it all organized and keep it off of you and uh, readily available and so that's a really cool added feature of the outdoor vitals uh, sleeping bag 
when it comes to packability, the green patrol bag probably packs down the smallest because it's so thin and lightweight. Uh, these two pack down to about the same size. The only difference is, is the bags that come with them. So the patrol bag itself doesn't come with a bag, but if you buy the whole MMSS, uh, it comes with a bag to put the whole thing in. Uh, the bag for the TNH Outdoors is just a bag with four compression straps and a hole on top, and then you just slide the compression straps over the hole and then you cinch it down where the outdoor vitals actually has more of a traditional style stuff, stuff sack uh, with the lid so you put your uh, sleeping bag inside of here and then you put the lid on and then you cinch down the cinch buckles and uh, this bag is just a little bit heavier duty there's more quality to this bag than this bag and so if you are one of those people that like to put it in the stuff sack and cinch it down small, uh, there's a difference between the bags as well. But I know a lot of people just shove it into the bottom of their uh, backpack. They don't really use the uh, bags. So that's not really a deciding factor. But when it comes to the size, I don't fit in the Teenage Outdoors, but I recommend this to people that are looking for a very inexpensive top quilt. Uh, I also recommend it to somebody that's really tall uh, because if you don't fit in the patrol bag or the outdoor vitals bag because you're too tall, you might be able to fit into the TNH Outdoors. Uh, I'm gonna call it a top quilt. You'll be able to use it as a top quilt and sleep comfortably. Uh, the sleeping bag that I'm gonna be using most is probably gonna be this outdoor vitals one. Uh, I like the extra loft, I like how uh, warm it is, I like how comfortable it is. Uh, the patrol bag served me well for many, many years. Uh, I like this bag a lot, but I really like the warmth and the comfort that this brings. Uh, another thing that I want to show you guys is I want to I wanna let you guys know that when it comes to the patrol bag, it's a little noisy. The Outdoor Vitals bag is a little noisy. And the TNH Outdoors bag is a lot noisy. And so with that, I know that's a factor a lot of people uh, consider too when they're buying sleeping gear. They want something that's quiet and that uh, is going to make it so that it's not annoying them as they're sleeping. And so these two are probably the same. And uh, this one is very loud. This one's really loud. And so with that being said, I want to know what do you look for when you purchase a sleeping bag? Uh, do you look at the zippers and the build quality? Or do you just go for warmth and packability? Let me know in that comment section down below. Then make sure to like and share this video to help spread that knowledge and your ideas to the people we care about most. And as always, don't forget to subscribe and come join the pack. I have a new video every Sunday and Thursday, and I can't wait to see you on the next one. Thanks, guys.